a person who's interested in actually uh, breaking into this industry, uh, do you have, like you already mentioned, in terms of uh, being able to reach out when where possible, do you have any other further advice for immigrants that want to break into either machine learning space or uh, potentially like software engineering or other uh, computer science based? Yeah, I think with machine learning, uh, I think having a background in statistics, engineering or math or even physics definitely helps. In many cases, that is indeed one of the hard requirements. But I've still seen lots of people belonging to non-technical backgrounds entering this space as well. I would encourage people to focus more on titles that are titled data science as opposed to machine learning, because sometimes, and it's weird how titles are defined these days, but data science roles actually expect more domain expertise as well. So if you, for example, if you're working in the financial industry and you you have good information and knowledge of the, of the finance, you are better off applying for a data science role in a financial industry setup as well. For some people, I've seen that having a master's degree definitely helps. In some cases, I've seen attending a six month or an eight month boot camp has also worked for some people. Interestingly, Another thing that works for some people is internal rotations within the company. And although it's yeah. not very common, I had one instance back at RBC where I had a colleague who had no background in software engineering or even physics or any kind of STEM field. She was a pure risk management expert. And just because she wanted to have a taste of data science and machine learning, she requested for an internal rotation and the company was willing to set up a one or two year stint for her in a machine learning team. And that is how she actually joined her team as for one or two years, I think. And the company was willing to provide her with all the learning resources and enough time to settle in the role and learn from scratch. Although I think not many, not many companies would do this, but I think it's still worth a shot. 